this study, what we are trying to accomplish is uh, uh, we want to uh, look at how soot aerosol particles, which are emitted from, say, diesel exhaust, you know, uh, truck exhaust, for example, uh, these are tiny uh, particles that contain, contain black carbon, uh, and it, uh, black carbon is known to absorb sunlight, uh, cause which can cause warming of the atmosphere. So uh, we are trying to recreate what happens out in the atmosphere in the chamber under very controlled conditions and we are trying to um, basically mimic the processes that happen in the atmosphere. So we sample the, um, the particles from the chamber and then for the photoacoustic instruments which measure the, the uh, absorption and scattering of the particles um, so there's a, there's a laser that hits the particle so when the laser hits the black carbon particles, it hits the particle, and the particles um, it generates heat, and then it generates a pressure wave that can be measured. So we, we have a little uh, diesel engine out in the, in the open. We run that to make the, the, the soot particles. And then we plumb it in into the chamber uh, and uh, inject uh, a precursor for secondary organic aerosol, uh, half of pinene. When it oxidizes in the air with ozone or OH radicals, it will form uh, oxygenated vapors that can condense on the soot particles that are present in the chamber. And so these particles get coated with alpha pinene. Uh, and so once these uh, organic aerosols condense on it, then the fractal collapses. And the theory is that uh, uh, a black carbon sphere coated with a transparent material like organic aerosol will enhance the absorption of this of the black carbon core uh, by up to a factor of two or more.